Hi guys, and welcome back to day 10 of uh, subsistence. Our base is looking okay. It's kind of like a circular tube. <laughs> but I kind of like it. I mean, uh, I really like my base. It's small. And you... This game is by... F I think the only game in which you can't build large. I mean, you can build large, but uh, it will take your whole freaking life to do that. <laughs> and uh, yeah, uh, works with a larger base if you play co-op with a friend or more than one friend, so you can freaking harvest that uh, wood faster, because uh, the rate you harvest, uh, the way you harvest the wood uh, on solo play, it's terrible, I mean. You literally have to spend uh, half of your day harvesting wood each time. So I'm not gonna do a larger base. Maybe we can uh, expand it, like, I don't know, after <laughs> one year, <laughs> of one real year of playing this game, and we're gonna be able to make a larger base. But right now, no way I will do that because uh, it will take too much freaking time to, to expand that base. My objectives for today are, uh, as uh, you may know, I think the trick with jumping works here too. I'm not gonna spend my whole life harvesting wood into this game. But, but, every single episode we have to harvest at least 20 or 25 uh, logs so we can have a, a constant supply of uh, logs. The base is quite okay, kind of finished, but uh, I need to make like a porch in front of the front of the base that goes straight to to the lake so I can fill up some of the bidons easier my goal is to make that stupid luck pick for today and uh, for in order to do that I need to wait the power to go up to 500 so for only one freaking luck pick you need 500 energy and that's a lot of energy. That's a lot of energy. So yeah, it takes some time until it uh, builds up. Until then, we do as uh, usual, what you do daily routine, like uh, harvesting uh, wood and looting crates. So another one here. We need another roof for our house. So I'm gonna make that too. Not sure where I should place my uh, solar panels because those morons, the hunters, when they uh, will uh, attack our base, they throw up, throw grenades. Later on, they will probably use dynamite and so on. But for uh, the first like 50 or so days. They'll only have uh, grenades, and uh, they will throw those grenades into our base. And uh, if they land anywhere near of your cellar panel, not only that will be damaged, but there will be a tiny chance that they will actually destroy it completely. We don't want to happen to lose our solar panels because uh, making only one of them is such a pain in the ass, you know. Okay, uh, so I think I'm going to, to place a roof on the base, although I have never done that before. 
the roof is kind of tricky into this game, so hoping that uh, the grenades will bounce off the roof and land somewhere else and uh, probably some of the solar panels should be up on the roof we shall see, we shall see ok, see? one of the hunter's base is right here, it's quite far from me so this is early game so they have nothing it doesn't actually worth looting them or fighting them although they can actually give you some uh, weapon parts you need to craft more advanced weapons like the double barreled shotgun and that freaking pistol the other the 45 magnum i guess is this one revolver 44 it's freaking powerful as hell i mean Make that one and uh, you're not gonna regret making it. It's so freaking powerful that that gun is powerful as hell. I guess they are not home. Where the hell are those? Okay, it's inside, I hear it. He just, he's right there, see? some health but uh, oh don't tell me his freaking bag is under the uh, he dropped oh my I can't take that freaking bag because it's behind those uh, is under the I never this never happened to me uh, before I it's literally dropped through the floors uh, into the map, I guess. No, it's actually under the. Uh, I can't take it. And uh, that's sad. That's really freaking sad because I wasted uh, two of my freaking very expensive shells only to get that freaking b back, back. So, thank you, game, for. Uh, or screw me over I can't take that oh my god that's so freaking sad how is this even happen I mean I literally never happened to me before but it happened to me now so at least uh, we kill it and now He'll gonna come and take his revenge, and uh, he'll probably attack us, and we'll gonna be able to loot his backpack later on. I wish I could uh, took that uh, weapons parts that he had. They always have some weapons parts into their backpacks, and that's actually the main reason I fight it. Can we find a position in which we can harvest this? Okay, that's a freaking wolf. Let's go on to the other side. Nah, I lost that freaking backpack and... That's freaking sad. Let me show you the, the new weapon, the rifle. Oh, he got spooked pretty fast. Stay there. If I will be able to hit her once, see? Why did I tell about this? Uh, the, the, rifle. the rifle is quite powerful. So we're gonna get some horns pretty soon. See? From this deer. They are not that important because uh, we're gonna find a lot of. They are used to make adhesive, I guess. And 
we're gonna get a lot of adhesive from uh, from hunters because uh, I intend to loot the hell out of them. Okay, let's keep going. A bear or a freaking wolf. I'm trying to head back to my base because uh, I was hoping that uh, I have like 500 energy already stored. So I can make that stupid lockpick. And the other deer just run away. He's right there. I don't even think it's worth uh, spending the bullets on killing them. Although the fats are... Uh, only the fat is the... And the uh, cloth is important. But uh, I'm gonna save up some of the bullets. I This is quite early game, so... It's hard to get everything. Everything is hard to get. So I'm not gonna waste bullets on killing deers. We just killed one. I just show you the power of the the rifle. The rifle is quite powerful. I mean, it's li literally it's the second after the, the that 44 pistol with six bullets. So that over there and no fats doesn't matter oh I need to make some uh, yeah I better make start making them now I'm gonna make like five of them fire starting uh, stuff I'm gonna place this in here I have some ash, some that some this uh, no actually let me make m like two more bandages they are way too important to not making them. Some of these guys, some worms, and here this, this 44 rounds, this, this, like that. And I have some, this guy, this guy, no, this actually iron. That's potassium, I guess. And do I need to eat something? Yes, I need. So I have nothing to eat. <laughs> I'm gonna eat this apple, but I still need more. And I'm gonna eat some freaking worms. I drink the water. I'm gonna extract the seed from this one. And we have those five uh, fire starting stuff. Should I? Yeah. I need that fuel brick I just crafted earlier. Let me get that and cook that meat. And let me check my power. Okay, it's 500. Nice. Let's get these guys. And I'm not sure how many of these guys too. I need some planks. And I don't have freaking planks. I only... I got just enough planks to make that one. <laughs> so, let's go over here. Here, actually. Uh, craft planks. Like that, you know. And I'm gonna try to find that uh, crate that we saw yesterday. But uh, in the meantime, I may actually cook that meat. Go down here, fill up the canteen. I need those some stairs in, on this uh, side of the the base. Okay, let's replenish our water. I need wood luck. I mean, like now. You know. Need planks. I have no planks left at all. Come on. Cook. Please. Okay, the meat is cooked and the water is almost cooked too. We managed to render some fat. Biofuel is very, 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 very important into this game because uh, 
you'll need to run the generator a lot in order to get more uh, more electricity so I'm gonna take the short road to the water only because there is a wolf which I don't want to fight right now because I don't need anything from him I mean the fat is always good because uh, you can convert it into biofuel but uh, now it's not the time, let's keep the shotgun out just in case we get ambushed by some uh, wolf and uh, beer related <laughs> stuff and I see a crate down on the beach but uh, here is a scrap metal I also want you need a lot of scrap metal to craft pickaxes and more advanced stuff later on in the game basically scrap metal is used in everything so you need a lot of it that's why I'm trying to to get as much as possible I guess that crate this owned but uh, it's worth trying to find it in case it's still there that will be amazing I think I saw another scrap metal in here, yes it was shining in the sun there is that big tree the six log tree and then we have to go straight on the right of that tree it's uh, right there I should be able to find the location, but uh, I'm not sure if that crate is still up there. Let's just hope that uh, the crate is still up there. And maybe we can take it now that we actually have... No, it's not. It's no longer here. I guess it was somewhere up here. Let me check that. Just to be sure. is definitely no longer here it got this phone it I mean it took took me like one full day to craft the stupid uh, lockpick and yeah it just got this phone it doesn't matter we're gonna find another one maybe later on in the game but uh, the one I just saw here, it was somewhere around this area I guess basically right here somewhere and it's gone another one will spawn eventually So ok let's give up because it's uh, clear that it's not here anymore maybe we're gonna be able to find another one and everyone will be happy, including me. Yeah. It's kind of sad because uh, losing that crate means uh, I lost so much good loot from it. But what can you do? What can you do? There is basically nothing you can do. Take that one. And let's try to find more loot in this area. I kinda avoid this part of this area over here. But uh, now we are... Um, it's actually f always full of animals. But right now we have uh, weapons. We can defend ourselves pretty well so we're gonna be able to to kill some animals in case we need to kill them I'll only kill them if necessary I'm trying to save every single freaking bullet the bullets are so expensive right? it's ridiculous I mean you always find like one uh, shell case and uh, one uh, gunpowder in those 
boxes and for one sh one shotgun shell you need uh, like uh, 10, ten uh, shell cases and 15 gun pod or something like that that's something stupid like that that's, it's so freaking annoying and hard to get and you, you basically farm for uh, the stuff like 3 days to make like 5 bullets <laughs> 3 days worth of uh, looting crates for like 5-6 shotgun shells that's stupid as hell I mean As I said, the developers, I kind of intend to think that they basically want us to spend our entire life. I want to kill this, and now I have to chase it. These guys are quite hard to kill. They will eventually attack us. That bear will gonna... See? Oh! I have a broken freaking leg. Hope uh, the waste of uh, ammo worth it. I need to craft uh, this splinter bank. Now let's uh, harvest this guy. See, we got this uh, ribs and we got four uh, sinew. That that's actually pretty important. Let's use that. And let's go. I just killed that to show you what it will give you if you kill it. It gives you a lot of goodies. Uh, that's kind of important materials. I kind of spend like three stupid bullets, rifle bullets that are... Oh, I have a bear on my tail. Dude, I have nothing. I don't want to freaking kill you, just leave me alone. You don't deserve two shotgun bullets. They are way too expensive to waste it on your freaking ass. Although you're fat, it's kinda okay, but... Uh, yeah. I was hoping that I'm going to find another uh, freaking crate, locked crate, but uh, that's not my day. I will probably find a later. I guess my next objective is to make that generator. I need to make that generator so I can uh, make myself uh, some more uh, more energy easier, you know? And the recycler, it's also welcome for the mass. And I also need uh, to expand the... I make to make a battery and uh, a mass uh, storage. I need to make those like now. But it will probably take me like another two or three days. Basically, what I should do right now, it will be probably the the battery, I guess. It will take me like, f so I can have like uh, 1000 st uh, energy storage and one mass because uh, s there are a lot of stuff. I'm not gonna harvest more uh, iron. And I may actually harvest more of them. I haven't found uh, another locked crate yet. That's kind of sucks. But what can I do? You n you remember like in the day two or three, I found like three crates, and uh, yeah, where is that bear? Where is the bear? Over there. Please l let me take this crate because it's uh, an ammo crate, so I need that. I see another one over there, or whatever it's that. 
I guess it's a crate. Yes, it's crate. Who's dropping all those crates? I don't know. Oh, I got a bottle of water. And another one over here. I got planks. Oh, that's nice. Is this potassium? I guess it is potassium. No, iron. Iron, it's always welcome. Although you need uh, all of the materials, like zinc and copper too. Quite a lot. Let's harvest this tree also. Because we need birds, we have quite a few birds on our inventory. I should actually start uh, crafting some birds. I mean, while uh, we're working around this area, we should probably craft some more boards and more cottage and maybe another fuel brick just because we can we oh dude yeah yeah I know don't be angry on me are you coming for me are you of course you are coming for me oh no 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 me, he freaking give me that disease again stupid 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 wolf I wasn't paying attention to it I was too focused on this freaking crate and now I have that freaking disease and I need the antidote and I don't have one so I guess I'm gonna go fishing pretty soon <laughs> Uh, anyway, I'm gonna f go fishing at night because uh, uh, we can't do much when uh, it's dark outside. Freaking wolf. And their disease. That infection or whatever they, the disease they give us, I have no idea what it's actually that the, the disease that the wolf gives you. But it's bad because uh, it takes a lot of your health and your stamina. Okay. I'm gonna wash my hands. I'm heading back home because uh, it will be dark pretty soon, so. And I need to kind of start fishing. Let's get this uh, iron and the other one I guess it's zinc, potassium and this is zinc, yes, okay, I'll probably harvest this tree, now lock, locked crate, now that we have a lock pick we can't find any other, uh, those rare crates, I will eventually find more but probably make like two or three lockpicks in the future I guess I'll never have uh, enough energy to spend on those lockpicks you know. okay another wolf over there bear actually let's uh, avoid that guy Keep uh, heading back to our base. It's dark again. I saw a crate over here. This one. We got ourselves quite a nice amount of uh, nails. Well, uh, we are trying to. Well, uh, we are trying to find the, a locked crate. That's always welcome. I love the nails. You need a lot of them. You will eventually don't need that many more, but uh, at the beginning they are like gold, you know. See, I already ran out of freaking stamina because of that stupid disease I, I got from the 
fucking wolf. I have to wait to get my stamina back. Is that a freaking bear right above me? Right over there. And I have to pay attention because I will not be able to outrun it. Because uh, my head it's actually not full. And I don't have a full bar stamina also. Okay, that's another one. I need to head back home. I only have two bo shotgun shells left. We should be able to find more. While we are uh, actually playing the game. More wood, as usual. And I need to kill my freaking disease, I hate that disease. Because uh, it's not that uh, freaking easy to get rid of. You need that uh, fish oil, so you can make some freaking antidote. And I guess I have none at the base, so... you In the future it will be easier to get that antidote, because uh, you're gonna get a lot of uh, medical medical stuff from the uh, from the other uh, hunters but at this moment that's uh, and of course I run out of stamina once again I should probably drink this water and refill my canteen we were in the water and let's get back see no more stamina left Close that door and ignite this guy. Let's cook this one, drop that one, that, eat this one. I should probably eat all of these guys. And I need to cook this one too because uh, it will go bad. And uh, you go there, you go there like that. New bottle of water some seeds, some feathers you go like that nice go there actually go here and close this door these guys go there this go here and this here and yes we are fine I need to start fishing pretty soon this one uh, we can uh, cut into holes and we'll get two more uh, pieces of meat, which is nice. And uh, yeah, I need to eat because my protein bar is quite low. Come on, do your thing and cook. Cooked, and I'm gonna eat this one. Oh, I'm not that hungry, okay. Cook the other two. Let me check uh, my potion now. Of course I have none left. I need medicinal tonic, so for that I need two fish oil to make one. S and I need three of them. Oh, that's freaking bad. So let's get that in here and then uh, making this. I need some worms. Okay, make three of them and place this in here. Is that meat? Is that meat ready? Not yet. I'm not. I kind of want to keep the meat uh, not burned. It's medium already, and I th I need to go fishing because why not? <laughs> I need to get rid of that disease and I need to get rid of that fast. You know? There are sometimes some crates spawning around the base, but not right now. 
Okay, we got two pieces. Extinguish this guy. And let's get fishing. Freaking stupid wolf. It will take me some time, I guess, until I will be able to get all those fishes. The fishy king is kind of way too realistic. <laughs> I mean, literally. Okay, we got one. We need more than one. If I get lucky and get the big ones, like salmon or something like that, it will give me more uh, fish oil. Yeah, see? I guess uh, if I get more of these guys, I will get uh, the fish oil faster because the big ones give me two. Yeah. Fishing is kind of boring and yeah. And the, this is already early in the morning, so I'm going to end this here. Uh, this is going to be the day 10 episode, episode 10, day 10. And uh, yeah, I'm going to start by thanking you all for uh, watching this uh, episode. And uh, if you like it and if you actually learn something from my mistakes, then don't uh, don't forget to, to smash that thumbs up button and subscribe for more episodes like this. So once again, thank you all guys for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye bye.